First, you'll want to find your installation tools, a knife and a squeegee included in your kit. Second, you want to lightly trim the edge of the clear plastic attached to your rooftop tent. Then you want to peel back the clear plastic acrylic and then clean the surface. To install the top, you want to lay the graphic out just like this. You'll want to flatten it and find the edges and make sure everything lines up correctly. Don't be worried if the graphic overlaps the edge. Then you want to take a piece of tape and attach it to the middle on one side and then the other. With two people, you want to pull it back to the tape. You want to lightly separate the paper backing from the installation material and pull it past where your tape line was being careful not to let the tape release just like you see there. If so, no big deal, align it back up and reattach your tape. You wanna use a pair of scissors or your knife included to remove that excess piece of paper. With the tape still attached, holding everything in place, you'll want to realign if you need, such as you see here, Then with two people again, pull the material back and have the one person hold it a little tight. You want to take your installation squeegee included in the kit, wipe from the middle, slowly out. If by chance you get a crease, a bubble, or a wrinkle, it's okay. You can peel it back up and restart again. Using a fluid motion, going half and half, go back and forth towards the man holding the As soon as you get close to the edge, you can lightly run the squeegee in this direction to pull everything towards the edge. Again, a wrinkle or a bubble, peel it up, start again. As soon as you're done with that portion, you want to run your card along all the edges to get it set in as close as possible. Then with two people again, you want to fold the material back reach under, grab that remaining piece of paper, and peel it out. While holding the material flat, you want to pull it back tight to the other side. With one person holding from one side, you should get a nice even tension. And then the first person will go back and start where the other side was stuck, and go back and forth, lightly at half strokes. Again, as soon as you get to the edge, you can turn your squeegee and go the other direction to tuck the vinyl into all of the corners on the channel between the top and the edge molding. Then you'll want to work your squeegee all the way around the outside perimeter to make sure that the graphic is tucked into the edge of the channel. Then 
then you'll want to take your knife and slowly run the blade lightly against the channel between the top to remove the graphic excess. Typically, you will not cut the material as long as you're light, and if you don't go too deep, you might need to try again just to get a nice even cut. And then peel the excess 